Lagos was agog on the 26th and 29th December 2023 when Prince Adeshola and Princess Oshiloe gave their daughter Adirile's hand out in marriage to her sweetheart, Taiwo Shebanjo. The celebration began at Odiaja residence of the bride's parents in Lagos. There was a rich display of culture as seen in the couple's pictures who were seen clad in gorgeous traditional attire, beautifully decorating the entrance of the venue of the traditional wedding ceremony. Guests from within and outside the shores of Nigeria trooped in to celebrate the beginning of the beautiful union. They walked into the beautiful scenery of the Ayo masquerade, the popular traditional masquerade in Lagos, chanting and dancing. It was a sight to behold as it served as some sort of tourist attraction for the non-Nigerians who were at the ceremony. The ambience at the venue of the event took us back in time to the early days of civilization in Nigeria, giving guests a blend of the past and the present day Nigeria. Without much ado, it was time to begin the traditional marriage rites. The arrival of the man that has gathered everyone who was here today. Without this man, today wouldn't have been necessary. Someone told me that he has never been kissed before. Yes. Is that correct? Yes, very correct. A letter notifying the bride's family of the groom's request was read by the bride's younger sister. We are seeking your permission to finalize the love and fortune between our beloved son, Taiwo Shemando, and our daughter, Dr. Adenrile Oshinle. Our son informed us and noticed through our keen observation that your daughter has distinctive quality that anyone would be proud of. She has demonstrated the qualities of a good ambassador for a God's home. She possesses intelligence and humility, which is rare and captivating. We pray to the Almighty God to bless the union of the two families through the sovereignization of the marriage between our children. We thank you and look forward to your favorable response at our earliest convenience. Yours sincerely. They surrounded the arrival of the groom. Taiwo Shebanjo, who made his entrance into the venue in company of his friends. And the moment everyone was waiting for finally arrived. The beautiful bride, Adirile, made a show-stopping entrance with a lovely dance performance surrounded by her friends. Like many Nigerian traditional weddings, it is always an emotional moment for the bride and the parents. As I say, their parting words, well wishes and prayers for their child's journey to a new home. Adirile's case was not any different. It was a sweet, sour moment, which was later taken over by excitement as Adirile happily danced into the waiting arms of her husband's parents, Mr. Olushegun and Mrs. Adelari Shebanjo. <laughs> Amen. 
warmly received by our in-laws. The parents of the bride and the groom could not hide their joy at this historic moment in their lives. My first wedding for my first daughter. My first experience actually. So I've not done that before. Yes, so I, I'm very, I'm very happy and um, uh, I don't know what to say. I'm short of words anyway. I'm going to be inside a lot. I'm going to be because um, because of the age she's been looking after me. Well, she's looked after me well as a dad. So I'm going to really miss her. I'm going to miss her food, you know. She, she cooks well, she cooks well. And then I'm going to miss her, you know, her companionship at home. Because when we're all at home and she's there with the siblings, I always feel happy. So uh, I, I must say, I will, I will miss her. She's been away before, you know. They all school in, in Nigeria again. All my children school in Nigeria. So, but I know they're coming back home for on holidays. But this one uh, is for is for life. So it's a different ball game. Yeah. I'm happy. I'm excited. Today is my day yeah, for seeing my son engagement. So it's a great day for me. I'm the happiest day for me. Brother is good. She is good. She is good. Respectful. She's a very nice lady for me. And my son is very humble. They're going to live long, happy marriage life, twins, triplets. <laughs> Give up me. For friends and family members, it was one event they all had waited to see. I feel so happy and I felt highly elevated. She's not a baby, highly educated and well-deserved girl. It's not because she's my daughter. She's definitely, to train someone is one thing, to receive it is another thing. She received it very well. And I'm glad and I'm happy she's going where she's going. Because I know she will not disappoint me. The couple were ushered to their seats and treated to a beautiful dance performance by a popular dance troupe in Nigeria. For the couple who were getting ready to make another gorgeous appearance at the ceremony it was a perfect time to reflect on how their love story began really a lot early and i went to cyprus for study and that's where we met we met in cyprus uh, at church uh, precisely and um i mean since 2018 we kicked off and here we are that's it it was my first. It was my first. My first day at the church in Cyprus, and um, towards the end of the service, I saw this black lady. She was kneeling on her two on her two knees, greeting somebody, and that that caught my attention. I was like, I wasn't even interested in, in the in the girl, in the lady. I was interested in the parents and what kind of you know home training you know has been imparted into her. So. That caught my attention. Uh, I'm just filled with so much joy. I just thank God for bringing this um, to, to life. I thank God that not everybody gets to find love, but God bless me enough to find love. And I just pray that the Holy Spirit will continue to be the third chord in my marriage. And I thank everybody for being here, for supporting me, for sharing me with so much love. I love you all and God bless. The grand celebration took place at the Monarch Event Center in Lekki on Friday, the 29th of December, 2023, starting with the joining of the bride and the groom in holy matrimony. Beautiful Adirili stepped out of the car and was held by her father, Prince Adishola Oshinoi, as he walked her down the aisle. The journey of the couple began as the clergy took over the wedding service.
joined together in holy matrimony. You now have to confess it. I, Paolo Shinbanjo, take you, Adonile Yoshinoe, as my wife, to how and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish till death do us part, according to God's holy ordinance, and yet to, I pledge you my trust. I, I don't really know what you take you, Paolo Shabanjo, as my lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love, cherish, and obey, for death do us part, according to God's holy ordinance, I here to, I pledge you my truth. In the presence of the congregation, the new couple were declared husband and wife and were prayed for. To whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. For as much as Tayo Sebanjo and Adirile Oshiloy have agreed together in holy word law and have witnessed the same before God and this congregation, and therefore, have given and played the truth to each other and have declared the same by giving and receiving the Holy Bible, which is the word of God and everlasting witness. And John of whom I pronounce that they be living together as husband and wife from today in the name of the Father. Adin Rile and Taiwo Shebanjo became one, and the marital journey began. Mr. and Mrs. Shebanjo. Flanked by friends and family, the big celebration of the newlyweds kicked off at the wedding reception as the couple's parents, the bridal train, and the new couple dance into the reception hall to the melodious music by popular gospel artist Laulu Benjo. <laughs> The event was well attended by top government officials, politicians, as well as royal fathers such as Oba Sahid Elegushi, former leader of Odua People's Congress, OPC, Ghani Adams, captains of industry and other well-meaning Nigerians. Uh, this is what every family is, is always hoping to do for their children. I congratulate them for having the opportunity to organize this kind of beautiful wedding for their children. And uh, I congratulate them for the kind of personalities that grace this occasion and the kind of place they use for the wedding. And I believe at the end of the day, they will be a very good guidance to the couples. Because uh, for a wedding to succeed in life, need the guidance of the both parents to guide them, to give them the word of experience to guide the wedding because uh, there always is be some friction in the wedding. But the parents should try to weather the storm so that the, the couple can last, can laugh at the end of the day. Again, the dance troupe ignited the hall with their dance skills.
And what is a wedding without a wedding cake? Really and Tai will got their guests staring at their gigantic, super luxury yacht cake. A beautiful sight to behold as they cut it. couple had their moments with their parents, a father and daughter dance, and a mother and son moment as they were serenaded with their choice of music. Ade Rile and Taiwo Shevanjo's wedding was a carnival, a beautiful memory created in the minds of everyone that attended and which could be remembered for a long time. We wish them a joyous and ever blissful married life.